representative of another element of the anti-war coalition. Her name is Amelia Womack. She's from the Green Party. Amelia. So, here we are. The same rubbish intergovernment international policy, different day. We took to the streets for Iraq. We've taken to the streets of for Syria. We've taken to the streets for Palestine. You would think that this government would realize that these wars are not the, war of the will of the people, but their own agendas that are killing people. We have, um, it's as a result of our governments that we, terrorism is uh, occurring in the Middle East. Terrorism breeds terrorism, and it's the bombs dropped by the UK and the US that are becoming um, recruitment grounds for terrorist organizations, fundraising their propaganda and getting more people involved. This has to stop. At the Green Party, we believe that negotiations are key to stopping these kinds of organizations. We need to make sure that we're talking to people across the Middle East because at the end of the day, warfare always ends with negotiations. Maybe that's where we should be starting. It's the people that are being affected the most. The people on the ground in these countries. And we're seeing more refugees than we ha ever have done since the Second World War. There are 50,000 people that are being displaced as a result of these illegal wars. These are people that we should be supporting, not the governments that are creating these problems. And at the end of the day, bombing people never kills their ideas. We need to be finding new ways to stopping these problems and not immediately turning to warfare. Once again, as I said, we keep taking to the streets over these different issues. And it's the, here in the UK, even if um, the precision bombings in Iraq, which let's face it, are very rarely precise, if they, even if they miss the, bar, the schools and the hospitals in these countries, they're going to be hitting the schools and the hospitals in the UK. We'll be seeing more, we've seen so many impacts of the cuts and once again we're sounding like a broken record because once again there's so much money, there's no money for schools and hospitals and yet again there's so much money for war. Thank you.